Hey Peaches, so it is the end of my week. It is Friday and I have been trying to come up with a few days. Wait, what is that sentence gonna be happening there? Wait, hold on. What? So I've been trying for a few days now to figure out what I was going to film to be uploaded on Monday and I couldn't really decide but this is what I came up with because you guys have been asking me for a Sarah Speaks video and basically I just forgot how I used to make these. Like when I first started I never had topics like laid out or anything, I just sat down and filmed. So um, it's been a while since I've done that. Can you hear the fan? Probably. So anyway, I am sitting in my floor again today in front of my closet doors. I still don't like um, how I'm set up for filming, but these lights are literally huge and I have no idea where to put them in my room. But I'm going to get it figured out eventually. So, um, yeah. This is basically an old-fashioned Sarah Speaks. I have my Dunkin' Donuts sweet tea, which if you guys have not tried, let me tell you, it's amazing. So when I ask you guys, um, when you were asking for a Sarah Speaks video, I was like, well, what do you guys want to hear about? And you just said, life update. So, um, the first thing that I've kind of been thinking about is just my anxiety, which is a weird thing to bring up, like, right at the beginning of this video, but, um, I have gotten so much better with being able to, like, talk myself down off of being really anxious about a situation or anything, and I just feel like lately, for some reason mainly through this month and the end of last month, um, I kind of have lost that a little bit. Like, it's not nearly as bad as it was, which, if you guys want a video on all of that, I'm already thinking about how to compose that for you, so let me know if you think that's a good idea to hear about my experience with anxiety. But basically, certain situations, certain days, I'm feeling like I used to feel where I don't want to go anywhere, I want to get in my bed and lay down and not do anything. And part of that, um, this is a little sneak peek at something, but I have actually been vlogging for months now um, because I guess I'll just let the cat out of the bag. So me and Dustin are going to be starting a channel together. However, um, since we've been filming for a few months now, we've actually started this way before he even had the job he has now. And so at that time, me and him were getting to spend a good bit of time together. So now that he started this new job and my hours have changed, we kind of don't see each other a lot anymore. Um, and when we do, it's like 9 o'clock at night or like swinging by at like 11 just to be like, hey, love you, bye. Um, and so vlogging for the past two months has been a little difficult. Um, but anyways, in there, I kind of just have a day where for no reason I am just like over it. I don't want to go anywhere. I don't want to do anything. I'm just too anxious to do any of it. And that makes me so upset to be there again because if you have ever been in that place where you don't want to do your makeup and you love doing your makeup, you don't want to do your hair and you love doing your hair, you don't want to do whatever it is that you love to do because you just feel like you don't have the energy to do it or something, that's where I have been especially this week. Um, so the time change happened this past weekend and I don't know if that's it because I've not been sleeping good, I just don't feel my best and here in Georgia we have a lot of pollen going on and usually I don't have allergies to that but um, whatever it is is affecting me big time. So because I'm not going to get all into that because I might do a different video, the main point of that is anxiety don't quit. It's always there. I feel like um, that's the biggest thing about people being like you can beat your anxiety. I'm like maybe to an extent but I feel like it's always there. The next thing, you guys have asked for a makeup collection video organization on that is not so good. It's not because it's not organized, I guess. Let me phrase it a little differently. It's because I have so little space for all the things that I have, so I've tried to come up with clever ways to store them, and it's not all that clever or practical. So I am going to do a makeup collection at some point. I just have to figure out... I have a vanity, so I feel like instead of going through the drawers, which is going to be difficult and not so cute. I maybe just will take the stuff out of the drawer because they're in a little compartment and show you guys that way. I don't know but I'm working on it. The other thing that I've realized through kind of getting ready for that video and also the giveaways I have coming up is I am obsessed with Too Faced eyeshadow. So right now, let me see if I can do this without getting up. I have one, two, three, four, five, six six eyeshadow palettes on like my vanity area and 
four, three. One, two, three. Three of them are two-faced. I live and breathe for Too Faced eyeshadows. I don't know how that came to be, but I think I've told you guys before, Too Faced is kind of a special brand to me because when I was very, very first learning makeup through um, this class that we had at church, that was the brand that the woman worked for. And so that was like my first experience with like high-end makeup and makeup in general. So they've always been a little bit special to me. And as far as the giveaway goes, I'll go ahead and kind of give you guys a little brief on that. I wanted to hit 500 this month and I, at this point on Friday, I am two away from that. So I think that's awesome. When I get there, I'm going to be giving away an eyeshadow palette, a very special one from Too Faced. And something else I've realized through this though is every time I hesitate on ordering something from them, the very next time I go to get it, like I'll be on the web page ready to get it. And then I'm like, well, I'll just get it tomorrow. Like I don't know why I think that, that tomorrow is going to be better than today, but I do. Get on there tomorrow, sold out for weeks and weeks and weeks. So I've had to wait a long time to get the uh, palettes that I wanted for you guys. So my first order that's going to be coming hopefully this weekend, it was supposed to be here tomorrow, but now it's saying it's going to be your Monday, um, is four eyeshadows, two that I got for myself, and then two I got, two, two I got for you guys. Then, as soon as the next one that I have to have comes in stock, I'm ordering two, so I can give you guys one and I can have one, and I'm so excited about those, I cannot even stand it. Then, as far as other giveaways, I have, um, one or two hair things. I have a body thing. And then the eyeshadows, I think the palettes are all that I have in store right now. So that's exciting. Um, and I have loved to do that for you guys. The first giveaway I did was obviously my first giveaway ever. And the whole thing was really exciting. So um, I went and got a P.O. box for that. And I am going to finally link that down not link it, it's not on a website. I'm going to put that below for you guys if you're interested in sending me something like if you have an Etsy shop or like try something out. I like doing stuff like that. So I got this new phone case um, a little while back and they do not make phone cases for the four anymore. It's done. I can't find them anywhere so when I found this one I snatched it up. But I do think I want a five or a six. I can't remember which one I looked at and I was like, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Um, but it's pink and I really, really want it. I don't think, I don't know. I am like the most unpicky person when it comes to phones because if I can call you and if I can text you, really at the core of a phone, that's all I need. But um, this one, like I've had it since, I don't know, like the beginning of college. So since I was like 18. And um, I haven't had a problem with it. The thing I don't like about it now and the reason why I'm ready for an upgrade is because they don't make anything for it anymore. So I feel like if I need something specific for that phone, like a charger, which I know I can find them. I'm being a little dramatic. But they're, star they're, just they're starting to stop. They're, they're starting to stop. They're starting to kind of get rid of all the stuff for that one. I think that's probably a trick to get you to upgrade. But also because mine is so slow. Like every time I open Pinterest, it crashes. Every time I open Instagram, it takes forever for it to do anything. Like and to post a picture takes at least five to seven minutes, which I think is crazy. Um, and I'm not talking editing. I use a different like app for editing. Then I just open the picture and Instagram still takes five to seven minutes. Um, and yeah, it's just a little too slow for <laughs> everything I'm trying to do. So my neighbor's about to ride by on his motorcycle and it's probably going to be pretty loud. Come on, Joey. There he goes. So the last thing I'm going to talk to you guys about is just my YouTube full-time has proven to be a actual full-time job. I feel like even if you're kind of prepared for like how tough YouTube can be, when you actually start going after it, you're like, whoa, this is like a lot of work because this month last month I guess I've spent so much money on like trying to get my lighting right like my camera fixed up like uh, my laptop so that I can run systems I need to on it so that's been an investment and finding time and the motivation to do a video like every time I need to is stress me out crazy the past two weeks for some reason so 
Um, I tried to film a video for this Monday like two or three times before this, so this is what we ended up with this time, but I do feel like I am close to like the halfway point of just being able to really delve into this and I'm excited about it. I really like sitting and talking with you guys and I feel like this is my creative outlet and I just like to share with you guys, whether that be giveaways, literally sharing with you, sharing tips with you, just my day so that I can hear about your day, whatever it is. So um, yeah, that's about it for this video. If you guys are interested in the vlog channel, which is not live yet, that's the other thing, is I've been filming so that I can edit and have multiple videos going up so you guys don't have to wait a long time on them. Um, if that's something that is interesting to you though, give this video a thumbs up so I know that that's something you guys do want to see. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that when I'm doing all my lovely giveaways that I just now have planned, like I have so many more I want to do for you guys, that you won't miss any of them. And don't forget to leave me your request in the down bar. So that is all I've got for you today. My hair's finally getting long. That's exciting. I gotta get a haircut though. It's really dry and messed up. <laughs> But I've been wearing it curly. That's the other thing. If you guys want to see a curly hair routine because my hair actually is curly, let me know because I finally figured out how to do it. Not super perfectly, but super close to super perfectly. Super, super. Alrighty, well, I will see you guys next Monday. I hope you guys have an awesome week and I want to hear all about it. You can comment me down below. Comment, comment, comment me. You can comment me down below and let me know how your week was. You can comment me on Instagram. I try to reply to every single thing that you guys leave. Um, and let you guys know that I am super aware of everything going on. I do have a Twitter and I'm trying to get some followers going on there because that way I can update you guys on just like verbal things, not picture things for Instagram um, a little bit quicker and easier. So I will see you guys next Monday. Thank you so much for watching and supporting me here on this super cool journey. And I will see you guys next Monday. Bye.